A high school football coach just quits in the middle of the season. Yeah, he says he's had it. Mm. Not with the game or his players, but with overbearing, verbally abusive parents. And as WBZ's Christina Rex shows us, he is not the only one who says it is now a serious problem in youth sports. The joy of coaching kind of gets ripped away from you. For 19 years, Con Chase has coached high school football for the last two seasons at Cardinal Spellman High School in Brockton. That is, until Thursday night. It's just general vulgar behavior. The head coach resigned after the team's Thursday night game against Bishop Fenwick. He says due to two seasons of verbal abuse from the sidelines from his own players' parents. It's just nonstop, whether it's the play stink, I um, don't have the team ready, they're just yelling at us. Fall, last year we had a guy follow our assistant coaches out of the booth. For a while he was escorted from games or went out a back exit for safety. But he reached a breaking point when he had to tell his wife and kids to stay at home. I can't have, I don't want my daughter to hear stuff like that said about their dad. Coach Chase's resignation comes as the state's high school athletic association has asked fans in the stands to calm down. The MIAA says it's had a referee shortage for a couple seasons now, in part because of verbal abuse from parents in the stands. We can never forget that when our coaches are coaching, they're doing this for the love of the sport and for what they're trying to do for young athletes. Robert Pearson talked to us from his car outside the Methuen Andover football game under the lights. At the same time on the South Shore, parents in Weymouth weighed in on sportsmanship from the sidelines. I feel like our parents and our students have done a really nice job of trying to maintain control. I step back. As, as a parent, I have never questioned anything that a coach has done. Despite her hands-off attitude, Deirdre says she's seen the vitriol. The parents getting angry, going down onto the sidelines, screaming at them. For Coach Chase, he hopes his willingness to step off the field will be a wake-up call for parents in the stands. Cardinal Spellman administration tells WBZ it wishes him all the best in his future endeavors. I'm a real person with real feelings too and I, I care about their kids tremendously. That's why I'm there trying to help them and be, do as good as they can. In Brockton, Christina Rex, WBZ News.